Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this DIY. For this one, we're gonna be needing some fake moss. Sorry if I'm talking like super quiet for this video, is because I'm not in my usual like setup where I usually uh, do my voiceovers. Somebody's sleeping like in the next room, so that's why I'm talking like this. And we're gonna shape it to a square kind of shape. Then we're gonna be using a small piece of fabric. And since I'm making this as a Tiffany's blue box, this is the blue that I'm using. The fabric looks kind of weird it's because it used to be part of like a towel. As I always say, work with what you have and that's what I'm doing here. So then I'm going to be taking a hot glue gun and I'm going to uh, wrap my fabric all around my fake moss. Once I have done that, I'm just going to be taking a piece of white ribbon, a really skinny one. I'm going to glue it on the back and then the other side and then like the bit that goes uh, towards the middle. And then I'm going to be making a little bow, which is um, gluing the two bits together, like that, the two ends, and then the part in the middle. I'm pretty sure most of you know how to do these things, but in case you don't know, I'm just kind of like explaining to you what I'm doing. And then towards the middle part, I'm going to be really careful with my hot glue gun. Fun facts about this video, I burned my thumbs easily like five times and it hurts like really bad but I'm just going to glue those two ends in there the bow that you are seeing right now the one that I'm explaining to you how to do turned out weird like one side was bigger than the other so I had to do it again and I ran out of material and that's why this bow um, looks super tiny in comparison to the other one and then I'm just going to place some glue gun on the middle right in the middle and on top goes my tiny little bow. At this point I saw the whole thing and I just wanted to make a smaller pin holder and since my bow was small to begin with I just went ahead and um, arranged the whole thing so I would just have a smaller more square I guess item. So this is how I did it. I just removed the whole thing. Sorry about this. Um, if you don't want to redo it as I'm doing right now make sure you make it a square as possible to begin with so you don't have to do this extra step and yeah, i'm just going to push my fake moss to make it like compress inside my um, wrapped piece of fabric but once i'm done it's going to be pretty much the same i'm going to wrap it again and this is where i burned my uh, thumbs like a few times hurts a lot so just be careful and then the bow and the uh, ribbon goes back in so i'm just going to glue the whole thing in again and then that's pretty much it i'm just going to place all my pins in there the fake moss is just so my pins have something to grab on a lot of people use cotton balls but i prefer to use this because i feel like they go in there a bit faster and easier than using cotton so if you're into sewing all that stuff this is a cool way to store all your pins in a cute way and yeah that's pretty much all i wanted to share for this video if you liked it don't forget to give me a thumbs up it helps a lot don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more stuff more diys coming up and don't forget to share it for so more people who can watch it thank you so much for watching sorry about the boys like that but i just want to share this video real quick so yeah i'll talk to you later bye guys